What's up guys, Rapid Rapid here, and today we're back with a, another video. This one is going to be the Crypt of the Serpent King game review. Hmm, let's get started. So this game is two years old now, I think. Came out in 2018. And you may be thinking, what are you playing this on? Yeah, I'm playing this on PlayStation. I got this game record dimension to me. And it's pretty bad, so <laughs> here we go. Uh, so first you get to pick like how to play you see the keys all your new game you can pick your difficulty which is cool You get your strength which you increase as you go and then you get different weapons which are pretty cool uh, I think the best one here is the bow is pretty good and then I like the chain ball or the axe and then uh, so you start <laughs> get ready for some good graphics here guys some PlayStation 4 graphics these game all you can do in the game is jump the square to press pick things up and then R1 to to do that <laughs> so yeah and then trying to change weapons I think and basically all you gotta do is like a weird castle game it's so dumb and you by the way you think you just take like a little bit of damage if you fall on that no you you fall right through that you fall right through the lava. You you fall right through the the lava. Hmm. So now you get these guys, who are like rats, and I, yeah, you, you can try to fight them if you want. If you're playing like I try to play on like the original mode, uh, you can probably fight them. But like on here, you just get hit every time. You, and look at what you can't see when you get hit. It's almost it's almost impossible to see so I just avoid those guys because this game is dumb And there's a lot of glitches too. like see how sensor heavy this is but you can get like uh, Gold you get your golden HP if you open these chests But you can't really open them because that guy's chasing you and you have to get these all the keys and then unlock it And there's some glitches in the game too. literally you just like there's just one glitch You just jump onto the thing and then you make it to the final round. It's super easy. Like, I don't know how you kill these guys. Because. Yeah, and you got your map at the top. This is. Uh, I, this is one of the worst games I've played. Uh, 10 out of 10, guys, for sure. Um, and then. You gotta, like, see those, like, tunnels. Look how dark it is, too. Like, look how. Look at the animations with the torch. Look how simple that is. And I can't see again. And then I can. Get the key. Hmm. That's literally all the game is. I mean, if you want to waste some money, I would totally buy this game. Holy crap. Yeah, and it's literally just the rat guys, and it's later on there's skeletons, and yeah, there's like serpents and stuff. There's bosses, but like, this is the, one of the dumbest games I've ever seen. See, we're gonna try to open the chest. There we go. That's HP. And like here, you can try to open. Look, look how sensor heavy that is. Oh my God! Okay. Uh, yeah. And then if you go over here, I'm gonna try to get gold. I guess we can't get it. But you literally just endlessly like walk these things until you eventually get more gold and stuff and beat the game. But personally, guys, I would never want to beat this game. <laughs> I, I I know people that beat this game, and this game is really bad, but why am I reviewing it, my, my ask, because that's why I do with all the games I play. So yeah, this game is $4, it's made by like, render code games, never heard of them. <laughs> yeah, personally, I would not buy this game, uh, yeah, I did a video on it earlier, I'm not going to do any more parts of that. Yeah, but it's really fun to mess around with to like have fun with you know like with your friends and stuff I guess if you want to meme or something So that's what I would use it for if I were you guys, you guys but Besides that literally like <laughs> I have No idea and then I guess there's these pit you can see and I think you're supposed to fall in the pit Oh, I just think this is where the gate is so yeah, you gotta like unlock all the keys. You see I got five right now. Let's see if we get them all. Mm -hmm. Oh lord. Ah! Oh god, dude, look at our health too. It's like... 
Honestly, the, the graphics are so bad. Like, look at the wall. It's disgusting. It's boring. It's... <coughs> yeah, I'm just gonna go with it. So, you know, you just... You think you would just... Oh! You just fall right through it. Dumbest thing I've ever seen. And that... Guess what happens when that's done? It tells you your enemy is killed. XP earned. Goal. Level time. Save progress. Then you literally go back and do it all over again. Hey, guess what? None of your gold saved either. So yeah, uh, I'd give this game a harsh 7 out of 0. Just kidding. I would give this game a 10 out of 10. I'm just kidding. Alright. The real score for this game, if I had to actually rate this out of 10 points, a 2, maybe a 1. This game doesn't offer anything else as a basic game. It's, it's I don't know why the developers even made this game or why it's on PlayStation, but you know, and why people play this game. By the way, they don't. But yeah, I would totally never buy this game if I were you. Waste of like five dollars. But yeah, uh, like and subscribe and uh, comment down below if you are gonna buy this game because I know I'm not. Well, I already am, but yeah. Well, anyways, like and subscribe. I'll see you guys later. Bye.